All right, good morning, everybody. It's your boy Akeen. Welcome to this vlog. Here to talk about the Texas A&M Aggies for the 2015 college football season. Now, A&M went eight and five last season under coach Kevin Sumlin, and they definitely need help on the defensive side. They remind me a lot of Auburn, a good offensive team, but they need to work on de definitely on the defensive side. Now, they did pick up John Chavis from the LSU Tigers. I think this is a definitely a good pickup for defensive coordinator position. But even though they do have Miles Jarrett, some people are still are concerned what is going to happen on the defensive side and if they will improve and improve. And I think they will improve this upcoming season. Now let's talk about some impact players entering this year, starting with their wide receivers in Speedy Noel and Josh Roberts. I think that both these two players are definitely a good tandem at wide receiver. And over the course of last season, they actually had 1,453 yards receiving last year and 19 touchdown receptions. I think this is going to become a decent in tandem for Kyle Allen to throw to at the starting quarterback position. Kyle Allen actually had a couple of good games last season and he should get that starting nod right away at the, at the season opener for the Aggies. Now speaking of on the defensive side, I mentioned a guy named Miles Jerry who was a true freshman last season. He actually registered 52 tackles and 11 and a half sacks as a true freshman and should definitely catch a lot of the attention this upcoming season. And one player in particular who was a actually an offensive player who converted to the defensive side was a former running back in Brandon Williams. He decided to convert to become a cornerback. And I definitely would definitely increase some speed on the defensive side and more depth at the, the secondary for the uh, Aggies who desperately need some help in the secondary. Now, as far as their incoming freshman in the recruiting class, they did an okay job. Starting with Dallin Mack, the number three defensive tackle. He's six foot one, 330 pounds. This was a good huge pickup to definitely address the defensive line. He should start right away as a true freshman. They picked up quarterback Kyler Murray, which is a decent selection, and they picked up um, wide receiver at 5'11", 197 pounds, and Christian Kirk, and the number 11 defensive end, and James Lockhart. I think that Lockhart and um, Garrett could work together as a excellent tandem in that, um, in that um, Aggie defensive line on both sides of the field. With the attention going to Jared, I think this is an opportunity for Lockhart to start as a defensive end. He might not play as much as a freshman, but when he enters his sophomore season and when and, um, Miles Jarrett it becomes a junior, I think these two players can wreak havoc in that line of scrimmage. Now, overall, for my prediction for the Aggies, I actually have them going 7-5 and five this year, just like last season, and get the opportunity to become 8-5. and five. Just, just way too much competition in that West Division and with the defensive side, really need to have a lot of things to address with, and John Chavis does have his work cut out for him. I don't think they're going to be playing up to par this upcoming season. So I have them going seven and five for the first for the regular season um, um, for this season. Now the next time I'm going to catch you guys will be just a couple of minutes. I have one more blog for you for today. Thank you for watching this blog. I'm your man Keen McCall. Be easy.